The empowerment program is born out of the vision of the association, which is to support vulnerable groups in the society. President and founder of the association, Erata Okoro, says the association will continue to focus on providing quality education and giving hope to the less privileged in the society. So we are here today in order to support stopping of uh, human trafficking because it's kind of taking us back. So we need to get our girls back. We need to give them the vision they need and we need to give them the encouragement so that they will be committed. But we need to empower no matter how small it is, you know, the number of people we can reach. Then we went to IDP because we know they need us. National coordinator of Fort Clef, Veronica Umaru, as well as other beneficiaries, appreciated the organization for the gesture, saying that more is needed in this regard. The children that are here are not our children, they are Nigerian children. So we want other Nigerians to also help them. Because together we can assist the children so that they will be good uh, citizens tomorrow. So we need government to help us and maybe pick one or two people to have a job, what to do outside. At least it would draw the liability within us here. They come here, we tell them that we need a prayer. Let them pray for us so that we'll get peace for our homes. The association also visited social welfare for widows, the needy and unemployed as part of the 2015 donation to the less privileged. In Abuja, Ayodeji, Abdul Malik, NTN News.